Please forgive me. I said I was going to do Reddit Saturday every Saturday, and I was wrong, and I scammed a bunch of you into posting Reddit content, and then I didn't react to it. So today, we're going to do a special episode where I give away... All right, I'm not going to sing, dude. Nah, it wasn't that bad of a time. You're not getting that. But basically, we're giving doing a special episode where we react to all your content from this month. A month of non-reactions. Going to give a bunch of you guys gold. Because you deserve it. Uh, so let's go to the board. Let's do this, huh? It's been a minute. I'm rusty. I don't know if I have my same chops, dude. Let's fire up the old Reddit. Has everyone abandoned me? Has it, Does anybody still care? Is anyone still posting? Is it dead? Is the thread dead? Dude, I promise. I'll never abandon this page again. Okay? Gonna give a lot of golds today. So get used to it. Right now, actually, I'm gonna give gold before I even look at this. Boom. Oh, look at that. A free award that I won. Here's the first one. Dude explaining how he made $10 million. Get up at 5 a.m. every day. 90 minutes of cardio. Take a cold shower. Okay, this is familiar. Uh, journal. Schedule out your day. Dad owns Fortune 500 company. <laughs> Meditate. I'm sure number six has nothing to do with it. That is how it be, though. I mean, people r really are like, hey, I started making my bed, and then I became, yeah, a CEO of a fabulously, uh, you know, uh, successful company. It's ridiculous. <laughs> I'm a diligent dabber. Here's my stoner coffeezilla. Would love to get Steven to see this. Hey! I don't do drugs, guys. I don't. I don't. <laughs> seriously, I've, I've literally never smoked weed in my life, okay? Okay, they all own Lamborghinis, right? What fake gurus want you to think their life is like. What their life is actually like. It's a little bit true, though. I mean, if you guys knew how many of these guys think everything's just rented. So, yeah, I, bu I buy it. I know nothing about the Brian Rose, uh, but the fact his campaign slogan is slapped across his wife's face in the family first section of his campaign website does not make a good first impression. <laughs> that reminds me. Play, hey, play that Mike Wazowski clip. We're working for a better tomorrow. Today. <laughs> She's like, Brian, here I come. I'm on, I'm on the family first page. <laughs> Uh, yeah, that, that's funny, dude. That's really funny. Jay Mazzini was just the beginning. Uh, you're right, Grant. That's why I stole your plane and girl, Coffeezilla. Don't, oh, I missed, I didn't say it in the right order. Dude, guys, you have to bubble right. You can't bubble. I read this first. Don't believe them when they say you can't have it all. Grant Cardone, and that's Grant Cardone. Hey, that's rude. I don't approve of this message. I would never. Guys, please. By the way, have y'all seen Grant Cardone go completely insane? Hi! Interactive boot camp. Hi, hi, hi! Hi, hi, hi! Hi! Interactive boot camp. Guys, when you reach a certain amount of wealth, you get reduced to guttural noises of a chimp. That's that's what Grant has become. This is uh, his ad, apparently. Spend three days with Grant live and achieve major breakthroughs. Hey, hi! This is not made up. Interactive boot camp. If you were going to make a parody of this, what would you even add? You'd just repost his post. Look! Yeah! 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 Anyway, so we don't even need this post. We don't even need the post of Cuck and Grant. We need the post of just him advertising himself. By the way, also, since y'all were talking about Jay Mazzini getting arrested, did any of y'all see him in court crying? Dude, this is unbelievable. He sees it all finally kick in. And he's about to ask the judge if they can have an earlier sentencing because he, he doesn't want to be in jail anymore. I'm saying, can there can there be an earlier court date? Earlier court date. No, not that I know of. Why? That's the judge. <laughs> Counsel? He's crying, dude. Listen, I know it's kind of heartless to enjoy this, but I have watched this man steal from so many people. And for those people, this is an incredible sense of vindication. But yeah, I thought I'd give you guys an update with that. Who are some actors who can play coffee? So, oh, by the way, we got to give these people gold. Gold for you, gold for you, and for you, sir, and for you. Def I haven't forgotten. Uh, and of course, yes, for you. Thank you guys for participating in r slash coffeezilla underscore gg even when i wasn't around even when all hope seemed lost who are some actors who can play coffeezilla here's one who the hell is this dude that guy looks nothing like me i don't see it who's up for a round of drip bingo next friday hey, what the hell is this 
Have some respect, Tin Mud. <laughs> okay. Are you saying we're predictable? Absolutely not. Oh, wait, that's actually on the drip. Bingo is, plays the exploding bomb sound. By the way, guys, good time to mention, we changed the new time for the drip to Thursday nights, 8 p.m. Central Time, starting from now on. It's gonna be a little night rip and dip, okay? It's different. I'll give that a gold, though. Alex Becker pivoting to a new industry. I know, dude, he's gone legit, right? He's like trying to be more about the minimalist thing. Oh, oh, no. Oh, he's gone the altcoin route. I forgot about that. <sighs> what is he? What are you doing, Alex? You know, exercise is an MLM. Exercise gives you energy, but you need energy to exercise. Sounds like a pyramid scheme. <laughs> uh, yeah, guys, that's why I don't exercise. Brian for mayor on Twitter has a lot of great stuff, but this is a winner for me so far. Makes me spit out, <laughs> out my tea every damn time I see it. Okay, this guy's for sure from London. <laughs> I... I literally drink, <laughs> dude, he really did that. Play the clip, dude. He <laughs> and I have a glass of a beverage. This is my own urine. And uh, I'm going to drink it today with Timothy. I think he's tried to scrub it from the internet, but Brian will never forget. You're number one, baby. Number one, LondonRealScams.org. That is a 10 out of 10 meme. Someone needs to tell Brian Rose how betting odds work. Hi, Brian Rose. Just a word of caution about these odds. I'm in fourth place here and I'm not even running. <laughs> Dude, I've been telling you guys the odds mean nothing. He keeps talking about it just because he's a grifter. Brian gathers his entire London-based support for COVID safe photo opportunity. Come on, dude. That's... Dude, Brian's kind of tiny there, to be honest. I, speaking as, you know, someone familiar with the Shire, I got to say, Brian is going to fit right in. Interesting question. If they're already earning in dollars, why the hell are they teaching it for dollars? Uh, you know why. Because they're not actually earning that, dude. Here's one of these types. He says 400k dropshipping revenue, 15 years old. He calls himself the CEO of Teenage Money. And he wants you, he already has a thousand students, guys. He's 15, but he has a thousand students. This is the epitome of that meme. And these people's Instagram is just like this, it's unironically hilarious. Takes risks to get here. Hard work pays off. Hey, buddy, you're not even out of your teenage years yet, bud. Go back into high school. You're truant. I could probably call the cops on you for being truant from high school. Go back to class, go back to science class and stop pretending that you're some big shot entrepreneur with a thousand students. All right, we're going to end it on this. Inspirational and real quotes from Mr. Testosterone filled left testicle himself. Okay, that's oddly specific. Oh, it's this guy. The last thing I told my mom was, you're not effing sick. You're not going to die. Stop being a What? Real quote. <laughs> Get some help, Dan Pena. Dude, stop trying to run like 12 businesses. You need like 12 appointments, bud with various psychologists and therapists. I don't know what to tell you. Anyway, that's basically it. Uh, just went over some of these memes. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll give this guy gold. Why not? I'm being very generous. And to anyone who comes to the subreddit, I'm going to be generously giving gold over the next week to stimulate the economy, guys. That's right. I'm pumping my own subreddit. And for this next week, I want you to focus on deep diving Grant Cardone's Instagram. Show me what, I know this guy's been posting some crazy stuff. I haven't had time to track it all. Dig it up. Let's find out what's really in Grant Cardone's Instagram. And for that matter, in the CEO Instagram, dude. I know these people are insane. Let's find out what's really going on. Anyway, we'll be reviewing that next week, guys. Reddit Saturday is now a regular thing again. I promise I will never scam you again. Thank you for watching. Thank you for supporting. Pump the stock, and I'll see you guys next time. I know what you mean. This ain't what it seemed. Nothing but a trick trying to sell me on a dream. But that was where you lost me. Wake up and smell the coffee.